Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this tip comes from a viewer or a subscriber. I guess they notice when I take some text off the internet or an email, and I copy it, and I put it into Corel Draw, and I'm going to right click and paste that it comes out this long sentence. And then I would take the text and go to artistic text. And then it's almost unreadable, well, one for my viewers. So, and I thank the person who thought of this because I never used paragraph text. So when you import it, or when you paste it, it comes out like this. Well, he said, don't forget that you can adjust the paragraph text box and do whatever you want to with it and then go to text and convert it to an artistic text and then my viewers would be able to read it or you would be able to use it in another context that's pretty cool and if you see that right there there's a a glitch with Arial on my computer and some other people's so let's change the font whenever you use a two letter font like FF Corel and I don't know I don't know if it's Corel or Windows but if you ever have that happen with Arial have to delete when you use Arial you get this little box or I do and I've had some several people ask me about it it's just a glitch inside of Corel or inside of Windows that does that. So just, you know, you could change your font to something that's close in Arial, like Arial narrow, narrow, and it doesn't do that. I think the font is corrupt. But anyway, this video was about resizing paragraph text. I never, as a laser engraver, never use paragraph text. I always use artistic text. And what's so good about this, you can edit this just like any other text and, you know, do some things to it and make it, you know, and you could do this without the editor. You could make everything bold and then say, okay. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.